It's radioactive Wirral. But what is radioactivity? It's elements that are so unstable that they break apart into smaller elements, or a burst of energy, which is light, that wants to cook you faster than a Russell Hop microwave. So where on the peninsula can you find such dangerous places? Let's start at the least dangerous. Did you know people, yes, people, are radioactive to such a small, small degree? In fact, if you sleep next to somebody, you might absorb radiation in one night. To keep it simple, let's give that amount of radiation the number one. But humans are more dangerous than that in other ways. So, do you eat? I hope so. Well, is food radioactive? Well, bananas are. Hard to believe, but it's due to the potassium that decays with a half-life of over a billion years. And we'll give that the value two. So what about those lucky people flying overhead? Or have you took a flight recently? Well, in one flight to Spain, you can absorb enough radiation that we give the value 300. Yes, so one flight to Spain is the equivalent of sleeping with someone 300 times. Ever been to the dentist and had an x-ray? Well, that's quite a lot of bananas, or it's 80 on our scale. Furthermore, some people may have had a CT scan in hospital. That's the equivalent of quite a lot of dental x-rays, 6,400 on our scale. So, while being on the Wirral, we are close to two nuclear facilities. One being at Cabenhurst, yes, the one by Ellesmere Port, and the other at Sellafield in the Lake District. Amazingly, that's only 1.5 on our scale per year. In fact, you get six times more radiation living closer to Fiddler's Ferry Power Station over near Witness. Do you live in a brick or concrete house? That's about 75 on our scale per year. Now, to put that into perspective, the maximum dosage for a nuclear worker is 500,000 on our scale. They use 20 million as a highly targeted amount that's used in radiotherapy. And 10 minutes after the core explosion of Chernobyl, it's 500 million. So now, a banana didn't seem so bad.